Hello viewers, today we are entering to the totem garden. This totem rose uh, garden called right, Rose Colley Yalton Memorial um, Hall of the Spamish Nation. It was raised in 2009. This pole was created to honor Rose Cole Yelton and her family and all those who lived in Stanley Park. The pole is erected in front of House White uh, where the Cole family lived until 1935. Until the time of her passing in 2002, Rose was the last serving resident of uh, the Brockton community. This one uh, name is Thunderbird for Robert Elston Eagle's daughter Laura. Human face between birds and wings represents the man in the family. Raven Robert Elton was adopted by the Hilda Raven clan while working in the Queen Charlotte's in late 1970. Olf for the Robert Elton son Peter Killer Well being held by the wolf. The craver include a killer well to remember its fairy trips across the bird in it and his grandmother Malta when they'd see wells. Women holding bones. It means um, it's a traditional lahal bone game represents Robert Elton's mother's Rose Cole Elton, illustration by Nola Jensen. And I can show you more to them. And every totem has their own meaning. It's a beautiful totem garden. And people are coming and enjoying and uh, This archaeological site and um, in between the middle one is um, called Capstellas, curved by the Wayne Alfred and Pew Taken 1991, is based on a design by the Russell Smith. The Koala's legendary part, the top of that, it means. Uh, it's a legendary bird, red cheddar bark, man with canoe, um, and then sisetal, double headed serpent, suity, and then killer whale, raven, where is the bear over man's head, and then jujunukwa, the getness. Yeah, that's a, uh, everyone has their own meaning. And it's like carry their own culture and cultural heritage too. We'll see something else, maybe more beautiful, more fascinating stuff in my next video. Stay tuned. Bye bye.